All right, I'm just gonna do a quick walk around of the bus. Um, also, two birds, one stone here. This is the uh, paint that I used. It's an interior exterior oil based semi gloss enamel, as you can read. Um, I don't know how well it's gonna hold up for an auto paint, but uh, I'm hoping that it it's fine. So, as you can see, it's all painted blue. Um, this is all roller down. Um, we used a kind of pricey roller. It's like a medium nap. Um, you know, it's not the smoothest, but it came out pretty good. Uh, we spray painted these lights, the light covers, but we took the lights out. I'm um, all we'll insulating those. Um, it's a tight squeeze through here. As you can see, we put uh, screens on all the windows. Let's do a quick walk around inside the bus. The hardest part was actually this door. You can see where we got the rubber done up with blue on accident. Um, it's not perfect either. If you look at the top, you can see where we got blue on the white, but frankly, we just don't care. Um, so here's the steps. I need to install a rail right here. Um, this is the cherry put in. I'm going to have to work on elevating it a bit. Uh, we're still working on the electrical, so none of the electrical, I mean, it's the, we've got the lines laid, but we haven't wired anything. Um, start from the back. <clears throat> so, the so bunks where I'm standing will be the shower. Uh, then this will be the kitchen area right there. These two dinettes will turn the off tabletops that drop down. These will turn into beds. Um, I guess let's look at the quick construction of the how we put these together. So we ran these along just to have more support. My brother and I are pretty large guys, so figured we'd want to do as much support as possible. So these chairs should come up. See, we just put little catches there, and when I upholstered, we put cardboard so that it wouldn't rip the fabric. Um, but that's about it. Um, probably take more videos of the electrical system once I get all that figured out. All right.